What's going on guys? This is Wegman764. It's been a couple weeks since we've made a video and uh, posted something up here, so uh, I, I thought, you know, I, I really I really wanted to make a video. Uh, I did open up, um, did open up a Lost Origins box, and I, I didn't pull, I, I pulled a lot of cool stuff. It was actually pretty cool, but uh, most of it ended up going on my Instagram page because I've been incredibly, incredibly busy. Uh, I'm excited to announce that I've got it's not at all a shop. It's not going to be like a storefront, but we've just got a little place um, back behind this building in this little nice, like, you know, <laughs> it's like a, it's like a, it's like a shed or like an outdoor building, but you step into it and it's like set up for this nice little perfect like card spot. And it's really small and it's not that big, but uh, why I'm telling the YouTube channel is of course, if you're in the area, if you're in the you know, North Carolina, Greensboro area, you can, you can find this shop, you can, you can look for it or whatever, um, because it's going to be, it's going to be in Archdale, which is, you know, around 10, 15 minutes from where I live. So, um, essentially what this is going to do though, is this is going to give me an address. I don't have to do a PO box, I think, finally. So I can just ship things from the address, like giveaways, so I can finally, hopefully, get some of those going. So I'm excited to announce that. You guys are going to have to check out the Instagram page, or I will have to come back around and maybe do like a, a little uh, reel or like a short to let you guys know like where the address is, where it's located, and stuff like that, because at this time I don't actually have that information. So we're going to start off with the couple of cards that I found at the card show that I recently attended. Um <laughs> Back to what I was saying, uh, these cards were at a card show that I attended last weekend. Um, I had dried paint, I still a little bit there. We did some painting today, and you know, I washed my hands and showered and everything, so I'm surprised that that little bit of paint survived there, so sorry about that, guys. But yeah, so these cards are going to have a theme, we're going to be sticking with a slight theme here. So, basic Charmander... Well, in the bottom there, you can see that's uh, Team Rocket symbol. So I like to refer to this guy as Dark Charmander. And that is the Dark Charmeleon. Team Rocket symbol right there. I'm trying to get my ring light out of the way there. There we go. Next card is, you know what it's going to be. Aha, I got you. It's a Blaine's Arcanine. I had to basically take this guy. Uh, I found him, you know, and he actually came with the Dark Charizard. <laughs> now, this is not a hollow, okay? Nobody get too excited here because... Um, can you see my face? Can you see my face? No, that's my lamp. <laughs> uh, don't get too excited because it's, it's not a hollow. Um, but I did, I did pick this guy up because he was worth around, you know... 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, depending on where the condition's at. And this is the best one I've seen condition-wise in a long time. And he was like, man, if you just want to take the Blaine's Arcanine with the Dark Charizard purchase, I'll, I'll let you have it. So I, I definitely cashed in on that. But I came back around later and was like, hey, I might as well grab <laughs> I a reel on my Instagram page for it. I turned that light way down so it's not blasting us completely on the cards there. All right, but... uh. Without further ado, we're getting on five minutes here of me talking and, and messing around and, you know. We are going to be doing another Lost Origins box. It's the only other one I have sealed, so I'm really nervous. Uh, I've been thinking all week about opening this box. Um, I've just, you know, and I, I've also got something else here that I would like to open up this video, like this one that I'm pointing at right now. But uh, with how long I think this video is going to be, I'm probably just going to have to shove it off to... Um, I'm probably just going to have to shove it off to the next video or set it up for next video. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Also, the jacket is back. Uh, I don't know. It's, it's in rougher shape than a little bit than it was last year. But it's all right. The, uh, the, the leather jacket is back, so, you know, it's fall, it's starting to get around the time of when I started this channel, we have to get into winter and actually get into the next year before that happens, though, so, okay, so, I'm gonna take this out of here, I just had it here for, I've got a bunch of bolt cards in there, and I was just kind of using it for, uh, display purposes, as it says, Lost Origin, dun-dun-dun, okay. 
Yeah, but that's kind of what I've been busy with. Uh, also, you know, things have just slowed down a little bit because of, you know, monetary reasons as well. But no, I've, I've, I've been working on some different things. I've been trying to, you know, obviously my Instagram page has, I mean, we just hit a thousand followers. So now that I've got a little, like, place here I can start shipping things from, it feels good that I can finally start thinking about, like, doing giveaways and different things like that. Uh, collaborations, all, all types of stuff. I'm probably going to have to reveal my face soon because I'm thinking about it and I just don't know how I'm going to stay anonymous. <laughs> uh, I'm such a personable guy in public and it would be stupid to not, you know, just get my face out there. And I don't think I'm that ugly, so we might be shocked. <laughs> all right, so let's go ahead and pull... Uh, Oh, man, I don't have any sleeves, so I'm going to take, like, five seconds here, and I'm going to go and grab my sleeves from in there, and I'm also going to grab you guys a couple of those trick-or-trade packs, and they're horrible, but you know what? Every channel has opened them up, and I actually did open them up in my last video that I just never posted, so uh, you guys are going to get some trick-or-trade packs, so I'll be right back. We'll talk about that. <laughs> Boo! Did I get you? No, probably not, because again, things just jump when I edit. <laughs> yeah, so uh, what I did with these trick-or-trade packs was I opened a couple uh, with that last video, again, that did not go up. I hate that I continue to shamelessly admit that. Anyways, uh, <laughs> uh, but when we went to the card show, I basically just laid them out across my table like that and just put a sign. It was like, hey, take a pack, take two, take three, take a thousand. Because uh, I can't justify selling these things. I can't justify even selling the, the pack of them with all of them. I just can't. I don't, I don't want to do that. So uh, in the spirit of things, we're going to probably do five and then I'll just hold on to the rest. I'm really not sure what I'm going to do with the rest. Uh, Halloween's kind of coming to an end here uh, in the next couple weeks, so i got to figure out something, right? <laughs> okay, so uh, we are going to go ahead and start out with a couple of these, just so I can kind of show off what I'm talking about. I think there's like three cards, four cards. There's three cards. The hollows first, right? Ye yes. So, yeah, Dustnar, and that's it. These are, like, that's the hollow you get in the pack. So, no, 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 like, that's what I'm talking about when I can't really justify selling these things because there's nothing of any value within these packs. Anyone who tells you there is, well, it could be valuable to them. So, I guess they're not lying, but maybe they're not exactly informed. Yay, Ghastly. I think there's a Gengar. I watched a kid pull the Gengar and the Darkrai, like, right in front of me. And I think, for some reason, in some packs, those are the hardest ones to pull. I think that one's a Gengar right there. I just spoiled it. Is it a Gengar? Boom! Gengar! What's up, buddy? Awesome. So we got ourselves a Gengar here. I don't think I pulled myself a Gengar. So. Very cool. Trick or trade. Trick or trade. If I had the option, I would trade all these cards for something of value. Me too. Pretty awesome. Cool. So, back-to-back -back little hits on stuff you want, at least. Not that you want, but, like, I don't know. They're, like, the cooler cards of the pack. Last pack magic. Can we pull an alternative rare? <laughs> Could you imagine, man? That would be so funny. If they were like, no, there's one pack out there that has, like, a super expensive, powerful card. Good luck finding it. Ooh, cool. I think we just pulled that one. All right, awesome. So, that is a little bit of those trick-or-trade packs. You kind of understand the gist of what I'm talking about. They're just not that... They're just not that exciting. Ooh. Ooh. Da, da, da. Okay. All right. Enough fooling around, enough jokes, enough playing games, guys. We gotta get real serious here for a second, okay? 
I want to pull an alternate full art from that box. <laughs> That's it. All right, so let's go through. Let's go really quick. Let's have a lot of fun here. It's been a it's been a busy week. It's been a busy couple weeks. It's been a busy couple months. It's been a busy year. Let's go ahead with a code card. Oh, um, no, I'll save that for the other thing. I opened a uh, I opened a Pokemon Go tin from Walmart and it was just disastrous. It was it was not a good tin. Uh, let's start off with Psychic. Lightning. I turned off my uh, my air conditioning, so I'm not gonna have any issues with like sleeves or cards sticking together or anything like that. Our first pack, not very magical. This is one of those sets that uh, I'm seeing it eats some people alive, and uh, others have been extremely lucky. So I'm trying to trying to get lucky myself. This is again my second box. I opened a one ETB, and I have one sealed. I think uh, fire. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but uh, definitely trying to hit some things that I didn't hit in my last box. That that would be pretty cool. All right. Yeah, we hit that last time, I think, to start, too. That's pretty funny. Uh-oh. <laughs> What's got? We got a long way to go here. We got a long way to go. I'm excited for this other little video that I keep looking down at, at my, uh, this other little product that I have to open that I want to open for you guys. It's pretty fun. I don't want to spoil it, though. I'm going to wait till the end. V-Star! Uh-oh. Ah, come on, you V-Star. Definitely want to hit that uh, trainer gallery Charizard, right? That's that was one of the like the only. No, I didn't hit any of the trainer gallery cards that I wanted. Let's go back to psychic. Oh, water. All right. Maybe there's fire in the back. Come on, come on. No, that is not. Okay. Well, been a tough love kind of start here for this particular booster box. Lost Origin. Lost Origin. My sealed collection continues to grow. It would it would stay pretty big if I, you know, didn't open stuff like this. But again, I've just, you know, got the urge. I have the urge to open Pokemon cards. Fire. Darkness. Seedra. I just finally evolved Kingdra in uh, Pokemon Go. And hey, I just actually evolved that guy too, so... Um, into the Rapirion or Rapirdon or whatever his name is. Licky Tongue and Slugma. Ugh. Okay. Tough Love Packs. That is also in the Trick or Trade Packs. And he's got a little pumpkin symbol. They could have threw something in those packs. Uh, Ultra Rare. Even if it was one in every, you had to go through and open them up, but it was an ultra rare. That would have been pretty cool. Like, in a, like an ultra rare Gengar or something. I think it would have been pretty awesome. But then they'd have to do that. <laughs> uh, let's go with metal. Ooh, grass. Let's see what we've got coming our way. Oh my god. There we go. Full art. Woo! Got caught talking bad about the ultra print. The full art shows up. Man, I'm always pulling full arts. That's an amazing looking card. The the red and the blue really just like really blast out at you. Very Halloween themed as well. Ish. Ish. It's kind of cool. Alright, so we're on the board there. We're on the board with, I mean... It could be an alternate full art, but what we're on the board with, to my knowledge, is a full art back there. That 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 looks stunning. It looks amazing. 
And we are going to guess uh, metal. I'm going to go back to back just in case it gives me the, the run around, but it didn't. It was fighting again. That was in the Pokemon Go 10. Anyways, maybe it wasn't. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Let's do... Let's do fire. Oh, psychic. Do, 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 do. Oh, there we go. Chandelier. Double swipe. Woohoo. Chandelier into an ultra rare. Chandelier, ultra rare. <laughs> oh, man. It's not that funny. Is it that funny, Wagman? Is it is it that funny? Funny how? <laughs> Launches off into a Joe Pesci Goodfellas skit. Funny like I'm a clown? Like funny like how I talk or what? <laughs> how it just gradually gets worse. Funny how? Funny like what? The way I talk or what? No, no, he's a big man. He knows what he said. Funny how? What'd you say? <laughs> Funny how. All right, uh, water. Oh, it was metal. It was metal. It's always throwing me for a loop. Oh, whoa! Was not expecting that. I didn't know trainer cards could take the place of hollow spots like that. That's it's kind of crazy. A little warped here. That's kind of crazy. Sorry, guys, I just realized why the lighting was, like, freaking out every time I was, like, moving around like that. You see that? Like, why it was changing color? Because I had my main light on. I was like, why does it keep... You're going to see that through the beginning of the video. You can go back now that I pointed it out. It's, like, orange, and then it's, like, not orange. Orange, not orange. But that's because I had my big, big light on back there. And it's, like, a fluorescent, I'm pretty sure. It kind of... Like, the way the cards would turn, it would, like, shoot light back at the camera. That's scary. Wah, wah. Sorry. I'm trying to freak anybody out. I might edit that out. Okay. Anyways, I am hunting an alternate full art uh, from this box. I've been watching people pull Giratina all week. Uh, I would love to fire. I would love to pull Giratina myself. Um, but at this point in time, before this set truly gets like way out of hand, because we got Silver Temptus coming now, and it's like, oh my god, it just keeps rolling, man. It keeps rolling. It doesn't stop. You have to, and you don't. You can take breaks. You cannot be a part of sets. You can hunt singles. But no, I like to try to give you guys. And although there's not that many people watching right now, if I ever gain a massive following, they'll be like, well, what did Weckman pull in that first year? Like, you know, when did this all start? And folks can come back and see where I had some success, where I kind of didn't have some success, <laughs> obviously. Um, but yeah, no, I just want to try to grab an alternate full art from this set without having to pay for it um, before I completely get too far away from it. Because the new Lugia has leaked the alternate full art Lugia. And there's a lot of people that do not like that alt art. It was like the same people who were talking crap about like the Dialga and the Palkia fire. No, wait, V-Star. <laughs> um, it was like the same people who were talking crap about the alternate arts from Astral Radiance. They do not like how that Lugia looks. And I'm like, man, whoa. Whoa, Charlie. Like the coolest regular hollow I've seen in a long time. But I, I, I get I get caught up with a lot of those. Anyways, um But no, Silver Temptus is coming out, the Lugia has been leaked, and a lot of people don't like it. And some fans have already, like they usually do, go and make their own alternate full arts and post them up. And there's one going around that a lot of people like versus the new one. I like the I, I like the new one that Pokemon is gonna do. It looks really mystical. I might actually flash it up somewhere. I don't know why I haven't been doing that. I can grab images from Google that are, you know, copyright free. I can do stuff like that. So we'll start showing you guys what the heck I'm talking about. I mean it looks really cool. It's a pretty awesome looking little guy there. So I definitely wanna find him, like everybody. Uh that was lightning and I already saw it, so we'll just go ahead and sorry about that. 
I gotta do this faster while I'm talking, but I like talking to you guys. I like stopping so you can understand what I'm saying. <laughs> Whoa, there we go, Radiant, uh, Radiant Man and uh, Hoopa. I can never pronounce this. Guard, Guard of Hour, Guard of Ear, Guard of Hour. This is like the third one I've pulled of this one. I'm pretty sure. I just need the Schnitzel or the Schnitzel or whatever, and then um, the ones from Pokemon Go. The Blastoise and the Venusaur, which I horrendously said last video, um, the one that went up, I think I said Bulbasaur and Venusaur, or something, Ivysaur and Venusaur, or something stupid like that. I clearly meant Blastoise. Fun stuff. The power of editing, though, gives us the strength. Let's go water. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And now entering the Twilight Pack. You are going to pull incredible fire from this Twilight Pack. No, you are not. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Submitted for your approval. A pack that has his favorite energy, but he only pulls... Doo -doo 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 -doo. All right. Terribly annoying. Terribly annoying. What you got? What you got for us, Lost Origins? Because this could very well be the very... I don't think this will be the very last time. I said I wasn't going to open Brilliant Stars a couple months ago, and then I come up on... I walk into GameStop, fire, water, whatever. Uh, <laughs> uh, I walked into GameStop, but this was like two weeks ago, and they just, boom, they just had Brilliant Stars, like blisters. I was like, uh, why? And he was like, I don't know. I was deathly afraid that they were reprints. Because I think Evolving Skies is going through a reprint phase right now. And Celebrations is popping up again. So I, I don't I don't know when Pokemon reprints and how the heck you tell the reprints versus the first editions. I really don't. I should probably seek out a class like that. Fighting. Oh, darkness. I should probably seek out a class or an expert or somebody who knows how to differentiate between first edition and reprints. Because uh, you can get finessed pretty hard. If you don't know that stuff. Finessed. Come on, Geary. Come on, Geary. Where you at? Geary. I'm going to start calling him Geary. Start making everybody mad. Like, bro, please stop saying Geary. Uh, let's go grass. Lightning. Everything. Sorry. Palpatine just... Oh, dude, that's that cool... That's that cool one. It's a reverse. Anytime I think of lightning, I think of Palpatine. Alright. Come on, let's hit something incredible. Alternate, full art, alternate, full art, fire's in the pack. All right, we got, we got fighting. Come on, let's hit something incredible. Oh, man. Not good, Charlie. Not good. So don't you read. Who's Charlie, by the way? Charlie's Charlie Day from Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Sorry, I keep saying that and I don't specify what I mean. You'll figure out as I go along. I've got inside jokes inside of my own head, which is probably the craziest thing anybody could admit. It's like, I think, what Ryan Reynolds would uh, would say. Like, that dude just says stuff sometimes like it's already funny to him, and then people laugh because the punchline's just there as well. So, like, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. It's sort of like that, where it's like, no, I think things are funny in my head. I have inside jokes, like, with myself, and it's always good. Uh, fire. Hey, it was fire this time. Give me a Charizard. Give me something. Give me something cool. Because I think that was a white border card. Trainer gallery. Trainer gallery. Trainer gallery. No, no. Negative commander. 
Negative Commander. Look at that. Look at that bulk stack. I'm going to start showing you guys the bulk stack like they do. This is fun. Okay, so we're completely through one side of the box. I don't think I've taken any packs from this side because you see how tight it is. So uh, from that first side, we're going to do like a little halftime thing here. Our pulls at halftime are... Uh, you know, I'm going to be tough love with myself about as tough love as this box is. The pulls are not that great. Uh, this guy was cool. These two, awesome. That's that's amazing. That's, you know what, if I only pulled those two, I would be happy and I would walk away and that would be fine. But, you know, all this stuff I've kind of seen before. I think I have actually seen that chandelure before. And, uh, you know, so. But the beauty of a booster box is we have a whole other half. Here we go. Blow the whistle, because second half is underway. We got kickoff here. We got kickoff. What are we going to pull? What are we going to pull? Water. Fire. <laughs> Whoosh. Yeah. Oh my god, there is actually a trainer gallery back there. Please, dear god in heaven. There is actually, I think, a trainer gallery back there. Oh my god, there is actually a trainer gallery. No! Oh! Dude, that Charizard's like eight bucks. He's like eight bucks. And he eludes me. But that's okay. Because we still got a lot of time. And I have not actually opened up like as much of this set as I think I have. Uh, I opened up a lot of Astral Radiance, and I kind of got my, you know, rear end handed to me at the beginning of that. But then we hit the booster box and pulled everything, like freaking everything. So we're gonna we're gonna hold out hope here that at least we're gonna get some stuff. And if we don't, I think I'm gonna be fair game with myself to take some stuff to the good old guys at Picante and maybe do like a trade in for the chart, like we did for the uh, Rainbow Charizard. I might just take a bunch of my duplicates and try to grab an alternate full art. Uh, I don't think I have anything nearly enough to trade for the Giratina, but I could probably swing the Aerodactyl or something like that. Or I could just pull him. You just pull one of them. <laughs> All right, uh, grass. Do, 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 do. I never guess psychic when it's supposed to happen. I'm not psychic. All right. Yeah, that's the guy that I got in Pokemon Go. Oh, I got a shiny, uh, I got a shiny ride on that I'm trying to get him a, a shiny whatever. Blackman764, Pokemon Go, give me the ad. I'll try to send you gifts when I actively have them. Sometimes I don't. I have 45 friends now, which is awesome. It's so cool. That's exactly what I wanted for my Pokemon Go account, was to just get more friends and get more people so that we can always be sending gifts and getting experience uh, from that because it's always a good time. So yeah, add me up and uh, yeah, fire, metal. Dude, this fly is kind of a, uh, this fly is dive bombing, man. He's crazy. I don't even know how I started a video with a fly in the studio anyways, but, uh, whoa, there he is. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. We got something double, no double. Well, yeah, that's kind of technically speaking a double swipe, even if it's just a regular hollow. Whoa. So we got the VMAX Mew and now we have the chunk of chew. This is my first chunk of chew guys. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I think I got a surfing Pikachu from uh, Pokemon Celebrations, but no, like brand new set. It's happening right now. I got my chunk at you. Let's go, guys. He's gonna be the new. He's gonna be the guy. And I'm gonna turn him so that he. Yeah, look at that chunky guy. I love him so much. Actually, I love him so much. Ah, oh, he's so cool. Okay, is he worth the entire box though? No, he's actually only worth like two or three bucks if I'm not. 100% wrong. He should be worth a million dollars. Look at him. Alright, what else can we escape with? These cards look a little... Nope, just the light. Okay. thought they looked a little dingage. Dingage off the top there. Uh, Dude, let's throw it for a real loop here. Fighting. Oh man, it was it was darkness. I consider like darkness, fighting, and metal there's just weird energies that I like never guess. But it's ironic how psychic is also in that pool. Alright. Can't get mad. Chunka chew. Chunka chunka chew chew. Pika chunk. All right, we gotta go. Come on. 
Oh, man. I'm, I'm really not as big of a Pikachu fan as, like, some folks that I've come in contact with, but, like, he does get some pretty funky-looking cards. Like, he gets some some cool stuff going on. Uh, Darkness. Why would I... I meant to guess fighting, I think, but it, it was still wrong. Either way, it was still wrong. Lumion! All right. My dirty, dirty hands here. Slugma, mimic you. Man, a lot of white border cards and a lot of not Charizard trainer galleries happening here, man. Come on, come on. What's going on? Uh, fire. You, you would, yeah, you would be fighting this time. Come on, come on, give me some. Give me some here. Give me something. Come on. Ah. Uh, okay. Oh, don't mess the chunk of you up. Chunk of chew, chunk of chunk of chunk of chew chew. He's a cool guy. Gigantics. Gigantamax, that's what it is. Gigantamax. Now is the winter of our discontent. Who's that Robert Frost? No, that's two roads diverged, and I chose the one less followed or something. Uh, water. Metal. Well, you're going to get rusted up, metal. How about that? Because I chose water, and this pack's maybe going to give me something, right? Oh, Radiant Steelix, and... I really thought that was something else. That's so terrible. I thought that was something else, man. The way it was, like, peeking out the back there, I thought it was a gold card. I swear, it was peeking out like that. But it's still a double swipe, and we can't be mad at that. We got our second copy of Radiant Steelix there. I think I do still need to pull the schnitzel. The schnazzle. Schnitzel. Schnazzle. Whatever his name is. Pidgeot. Have I pulled the Pidgeot yet? I don't know. He's a cool-looking Pidgeot. Fair enough. Okay, but... We're not out of here yet. We're starting to we're starting to build a nice stack here. Okay, all right. Did y'all get that one? Yeah. You can just pause it if you really, really want it. V Star. Come on now. Let's go trainer gallery Charizard. I've been saying it every pack. Every pack. That's not a trainer gallery Charizard. Okay, all right. You know what we haven't seen in a while? Grass. Oh, water. Well, let's water the grass. I got a stupid gimmick for whatever it is. It'll be all right. Boy, uh, boy. Alternate, alternate full art. Alternate full art. Come on. Gotta wake the pack up, maybe, and gotta gotta give it a little smack. I know people who like slap packs, and supposedly that you know stirs up all the all the magic or whatever. So let's go fire, fighting. You just love popping up, fighting. You just love choosing violence. <laughs> we are getting down to the end. Let's go ahead and break it. Quest is not over yet. We have eight packs. Eight packs of greatness. Of of greatness. All right, there we go. Sorry. Uh, water, fire, water for the fire in the back of the pack. Maybe. Maybe it's too hot for water. Who knows? Let's go. Come on. No. Negative commander. Here we go. Lucky number seven. Lucky number seven. Lucky number seven is a black border card here. All right, we're going to go psychic. Go psychic. 
Oh my god, okay, okay, and there could be something back there, I don't know, there's definitely something back there, but I guessed it right, I finally guessed Psychic, mark it in your place in history right now, Wegman actually guessed Psychic, and it was right, and we could be rewarded, we could be, we could be rewarded, we could be, I did the little, like, fingers too, like, come on, we're definitely gonna be rewarded here, right? Come on, oh my god, we're definitely getting something, oh, it's a V-star, you know, but that's okay, that's okay, that's all right, because uh, I did not have this V-Star yet, and I don't know if, I have, I have pulled, I've pulled two other V-Stars um, from this set. Why couldn't it have been a Giratina V-Star, though? That would have been pretty awesome. That's okay. It's like a $2 card. That's all right. We still got a little bit left here. That was fun. <laughs> Camera just went orange mode for no reason, again. Here we go. Lightning. Not so lightning. Here we go. White border card. Still some still some trainer gallery chances here. Still some still some uh Charizard trainer gallery. Green didn't didn't guess. Still some still some chances here. Nope. Nope. Four packs of greatness left. Four packs of absolute fire. You have to believe. To quote Amendola, to quote Edelman, you gotta, you gotta believe. If you don't believe, I, I, I don't know. That's there's, there's no extension of that quote. It's just you gotta believe. Uh, fighting, lightning. Okay. Well, then take us there. Give us the lightning pools. That's not that. See, see, that's not that's not a lightning pool. Oh, that is though. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, I thought I thought that was the reverse. Dark dark cards always throw me for a loop. Hey, well, another Pikachu. Dawn sleeping with the Pikachu. That's a cute one. Uh, that's my second one now. Uh, Mr. Munching Lax pulled me one, but now now we have pulled one. Not the trainer gallery I wanted to see, but that's okay. Three packs here. Come on, let's go. Let's go shuffle them up. Let's do Giratina. Three packs here. We got. We got to come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Or origins here. Origins. Give us something. All right. All right. All right look, 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 look. Black border card. We want Giratina love. We want all the Giratina love. That's all we want. So we're gonna go water. I don't know why. It was psychic again. I could have guessed psychic again. Are you kidding me? Wow. I was almost gonna guess psychic. I was like, bro, we should just get cocky and double up on Psychic. Oh my god, and we get rewarded again. Not really, but I was thinking Psychic. I, that's awesome. Didn't hit a secret rare this time. I don't think we hit a secret rare from well, that one that's that's kind of like a gold secret rare. I don't I don't know. I don't think he counts as a gold card though. Maybe he does. Alright. That happens. That's a thing. Two packs. Two packs, man. Alt full art. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Come on. Alternate full art. This is the time. Two back to back. Just absolute bangers. Just 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 one after the other. Uh water. Oh, it's fire. Alright. There's fire in the back. Come on. Is there fire in the back? No, no, there's not. That's horrible. That's horrible, man. That's horrible. <laughs> That's terrible. That is terrible. Last pack. Last pack of the booster box, guys. Oh boy. Come on. Give give me my give me my alternate pool art. I wanna pull one. I wanna pull one bad. From this set. And that is it, guys. You see that right there? Well, we can still maybe thing weird things weird things take the place of the reverse slot sometimes, so we'll see what's up. Let's go psychic. Nah, you ain't gonna get that lucky. Murkrow. Oh boy. Well, there's the there's the back card. So then nothing. All right. Let's go through the pools. 
not bad pulls. I mean, really not terrible pulls. Um, we didn't hit as many trainer galleries this time. That one's pretty cool. Um, we didn't really hit much of anything, to be honest. <laughs> we The Hyper Rare, the, Pika, the Chunk of Chew, and... Um, Where's my man at? The full art. We're pretty... I thought I actually... Now that I'm looking at this full art, and now that I'm really, really looking at it, I actually think I pulled this one already. So, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. The Chunk of Chew is definitely the uh, the card of the day, the card of the night. Um, now we've got the, the Mew and we have the Chunk of Chew. But I am going to take this moment to announce what the next video is going to be, whether it goes up tonight, right after this one, if I decided to record it tonight. If I decide to record it tonight, it will be Dragonite. What is he talking about? What is going on with Dragonite? Dun, bum, bum. Boom! The Dragonite V-Star Premier Deck Holder Collection. Yeah. Alright, so this comes with one etched foil promotional card featuring Dragonite V-Star, the same card I was basically holding, but it'll be a slightly different art. One foil promo featuring Dragonite V, one special deck shaped like a Premier Ball deck shaped holder. Uh, deck holder shaped like a Premier Ball. One of those two. Anyways, uh, nine Pokemon Go booster packs and a Pokemon Go code card for TCG Pokemon. So, uh, we didn't pull an alternate full art there. We definitely want to pull an alternate full art here. I'm going to go ahead and stop this one, and we will see you guys next time on Weckman 764. Peace out.